This magnetic coin slide can be used to test your silver coins and other objects. It's made up of seven neodymium magnets placed on a steel sheet. The magnets have alternating polarities, north-south, north-south, all the way down. This creates a very strong magnetic field. Here we have some real certified silver coins. On the steel, the coins slide down as you would expect them to. But when you slide the coin on the magnets, it falls very slowly. This is because silver is a good conductor, which creates eddy currents that oppose the magnets. This is similar to what happens when you drop a magnet down a copper tube. Real silver coins will fall very slowly down the slide, while fake silver coins will slide normally. See that speed up and slow as it gets to each uh, magnet. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. And here's a silver bar. This can also be used to help distinguish between different metals. Here is a copper Indian head penny we found. The copper does a similar thing, although it's not quite as noticeable as the silver. This early 19th century tin lid must be made out of some conductive material, maybe even 100% tin, because it slides very slowly. As you can see, this old belt buckle slides normally, so it must be made out of a material like brass or pewter. It's very easy to make a slide like this. We use seven two inch by one inch by eighth inch thick neodymium magnets placed edge to edge, alternating polarities. The steel sheet helps keep the magnets in place. It's also a good idea to place something over the magnets, like a thin piece of fabric, to help prevent your coins from getting scratched. Here is a 3D printed slide we made using the same concept. Thanks for watching. Check out some of our other videos and be sure to subscribe.